All right, let's see where the divine masculines are because y'all been cutting up and I just want to see where y'all at, okay? And we're also going to see the divine feminine and karmic too, all right? So let's see. Divine masculine, how you starting this week off, big zaddy, okay? It's big zaddy over here. How big zaddy starting it off, all right? Let me tell y'all something. This is why I call him Big Daddy. Oh, he love it when you call him Big Papa. Yes. Big Daddy know what's up. Big Daddy. Big Daddy leave us the things out in the call here. Uh, Divine Masculine said, I don't have time, baby. I don't have time. I'm about this paper. And I'm leaving everything else behind. It ain't about this paper at this given point in time. Come on, Big Daddy. Mm-hmm. Changing your perspective. I am, you know what the divine masculines I'm picking up on y'all. Y'all better be divine. Y'all better be divine. I swear I love y'all. I swear I love a man that can get it together, Lord. Thank you. Mm. Come on, divine masculine. Get it. Get it. Get it. I, I, I pop some for divine masculine on this energy here. I ain't even gonna. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. But I will. Okay. Um, divine masculines. Oof. I'm a little parched here. Um, <laughs> y'all, you, you're doing the doggone thing. You're changing your perspective. You, you, you getting your money. Hello. Hello. Stability on deck. You got your eyes on a nice little prize. You want it. You changing your perspective on love, opening your heart. Like, this divine masculine heart chakra is open. Yay! Look. All right. Let me let me get you excited about divine masculine. Okay. This man wants to commit. Thank you, God, for the divine masculines that want to commit. Thank you, God. This man want to commit. Yeah, this man really wants to commit to you, this divine masculine. They are changing their life here, like their perspective. Like this person was very much so um, traditional, but now this person is like, okay, my divine feminine kind of spiritual. Let me see what she working with. But she traditional, spiritual. I like that. Let me see what. Yeah, I could do that. So this masculine is really analyzing things because this person is really ready to make a move. I'm telling you, they love you. They see you as a loving, caring individual, and they want to balance all of this out. Come on, masculine. Hello? Divine fem. We got, we got, cause, okay, divine family. Divine feminist, baby. I just been waiting, okay? I'm, I'm out here learning some new things. I'm, I'm, you know, sprucing up my, my, um, my, um, my knowledge on some things here. I'm just out here just doing my thing. I'm just. You know, I'm growing. Okay, I'm trying to... I feel like this this uh, Divine Feminine, you're grooming yourself to be a wife and not even knowing why you're grooming yourself to be a wife. But it's really because it is masculine. Like you feel somebody coming. This person felt you grooming your life for a husband and they started acting like a husband and you felt them grooming their life like a real masculine and you started acting like a wife. Hello? That's how it go when y'all twinning. Okay, that's how it go. Both of y'all are getting ready for commitment. Wow. I told y'all, y'all getting ready. Ending cycles, nothing and no one can come in between this connection. Like, y'all really, and y'all ain't even, y'all talked about it, but it's like, this is just energetically happening here. Yeah, you ended somebody around you, divine feminine, just do not want you to have this. Um, somebody, it's a crazy ex out here. This crazy ex don't want you to have this commitment to nobody. They say, if you ain't going to give them that good good no more, you ain't giving that good good to nobody else. I'm telling you, the devil just popped out of here. They said, if you ain't giving that good good to me, you ain't giving it to nobody else. And I hope you don't think that you about to do all of this on me. You said, um, excuse me. Baby, my manifestations are about to come in here. And this is what's going on. You manifest this masculine even acting this way. And this masculine and you, both of y'all were in a relationship. 
what took so long is that this masculine went and got in a relationship. Feminine, I ain't even gonna lie. You were like, oh, he got me messed up. Okay? And then you went into a, a this person, it was like they were almost done with in their karmic cycle in their relationship that they were with, that they were in. But then you said, forget this. I am whatever. I'm about to go get me somebody. And you fell in love with a karmic, which prolonged the whole situation again. But that person, your person got rid of their karmic. And then boom, you got rid of yours. Now this is where y'all are. Y'all both are like, no, I'm not, I'm not about to sit around and get with another karmic here. I'm too grown for this. I'm going to get myself together and I'm going to get what I want. And both of y'all know that the only people that y'all have ever wanted, that ever did it for the both of y'all was each other. That's it. Can't nobody do it like you and can't nobody do it like him for y'all. That's it. So y'all were like, I'm tired of this um, dumb shit. Like we got to, we got to do what we got to do. Cause we ain't getting no young guy out here in these streets. But it was like a tip for tat thing, and then boom, you know, ten of cups. And the only reason why this person chose that karmic because of you, I mean, over you, is because that person was in heel. That person knew that they could run and 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 and, and trample over that karmic, and their narcissistic ways wanted to do that at the time. But y'all were, y'all were clashing because you're you ain't with that narcissistic stuff. You're going to treat me fairly or we're not going to, you know what I'm saying? That person had healing to do. And when that person started healing, they looked up and the only one they, that, that that ever knew them could handle them the way that, that you tame them, all of that was you. Was you. It's up to y'all. I don't care if you don't want this man. I don't care if they can eat rocks and all of that. I don't care. This is what the message is coming out. This is for somebody, and Spirit says somebody want their man, okay? Here you go. But I feel like your whole intention is to be happy now, Divine Feminines. Let's see what's going on with this divine couple here. How is this going to pan out? What's the next move? Hmm. Excuse me. Somebody about to be very happy that somebody's about to come through with something stable here. Somebody's about to come through with something stable. It's taking this person a minute because they want to work on it to make sure this is a masterpiece. Not it's a masterpiece. Uh, that song there is coming in my head. My, mm -mm -mm -mm. I can't figure it out, but yeah. Let's see. Yeah, this person is stuck in their head on how they're about to make this pa passionate move towards you because they really want to woo you because of the shit y'all been through. They really want to woo you. They like, this is it. Because once I do this, ain't no more going back. Ain't no more women. Ain't no more men. Ain't no more nobody. It's just me and this person, and I want it to be... Yeah, they're about to message you, impulsively message you, messaging you. What's going on with your karmics on your end? What's going on on the collective's end? Their karmics. Their karmics. Please and thank you, spirit. Woo! Baby, disaster after disaster. What happened? Somebody thought they were finna do some magic on you? Baby, and got toe up, and that's the truth. Toe up, baby. They game. Ooh. What's going on with the, mas with, with the masculine karmics? Baby, somebody got they wig splits over here messing with you, baby. Ain't no, ain't no telling, baby. What's going on with the karmics on the masculine side? Woo! Damn. Foundations are ending. Not grounded. Baby, on both of y'all ends, this is why they mad. This is why y'all had to keep it a secret and all of that. These people are mad. They losing on both ends, but y'all about to be winning here. What's the mutual uh, feelings between the, the divine collective and their counterpart here? What's the mutual feelings, please? Give me one before it cuts out. I'm telling y'all, blocking off all pain, all stress, because it's not about anybody else anymore. Y'all are done with all of that. Y'all left. It's done. 